Hello guys, today I will show you how you can give an order and sort your Twitter bookmarks by categories without paying on any subscription to Twitter Blue or any kind of tool which want to charge you for this feature. I could think this is the feature Twitter lack the most, be able to categorize the bookmarks. Well, with what I'm going to show you now, you are going to forget that mess. The tool which will help us to do this is TweetDeck. TweetDeck is a tool out of Twitter, but only few people leverage the features uh, TweetDeck offers. So we can go to TweetDeck. Uh, taking account taking account this, uh, TweetDeck only works on web browsers. There is no TweetDeck app. You can use TweetDeck in your smartphone's browser, but I think it's more easy to use it in laptop or desktop computer. So to in order to go to TweetDeck, we are going to open a new tab in, in our web browser, and you are going to type uh, feedback. It's feedback .com. Well, uh, the first you need to do is uh, be be logging uh, uh, in your Twitter account, and then uh, when you open TweetDeck, um, it takes automatically uh, your Twitter account. So. Well, this is my Twitter dashboard. Here is where I have uh, many of the many of my Twitter bookmarks sorted by by categories. So, uh, how you can use it to categorize your own bookmarks? Well, it's very easy. Uh, you are going to you are going to click here in Add Column, and here you are going to click on Collection. Uh, these are the collections I created uh, for my bookmarks. Uh, well, um, and, uh, we guess uh, we're going to guess, and uh, we need a collection called YouTube. YouTube, cool. and you click on save. No, it's a new, a new column called YouTube. So what you need to do to put your bookmarks here? Well, you go to your Twitter bookmarks and here I have one of the two. Uh, you are going to the share button of the of the tweets you want to save and uh, click on copy link to tweet and go back to TweetDeck and in your and you choose a uh, category in this case in your choosing column you go here to and to enter treat url and you paste mm. the link of of the tweet you just copy and here it saves uh, the um, the tweet. Uh, we are going to do it with an ours. Uh, we are going to take this and compiling to tweet. And we are going to the category where I want to see that. And if here, paste the link to the tweet. And here, here appears. We are going to do another example. And we are going to to respective category. And model here. Hit of Google Ads. This is the way you can give a structure to your Twitter bookmarks. If you don't want to see so many columns. You can you can go here to the filters button 
and then click on remove. But don't worry, the, the collection was not deleted, but it was removed from your from your dashboard. If you can make it appear again, uh, you can click here on that column collection, and here you can select the 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 collection you want to show. Uh, note that uh, here you can you can see the content of every collection too. Uh, and here is where you can uh, delete uh, uh, delete forever a collection. Uh, removing uh, from the first button uh, will not will not delete uh, your collection. But if you click here, it will delete when you select your collection and click on delete, the collection will be will be deleted uh, forever. Well, uh, after uh, you selected um, the collection, you place on that column, and here, paste that column again. You can remove uh, a tweet from a collection too, um, only clicking on the X, on the X button on the tree you want to remove. Well, if you want to share your collections, you can do it too. Only have to click here on filters bottle, then click on share. It gives three options. We are going to select viewintwitter.com and it opens a new tab where show all tweets from that collection. So you only need to copy the URL of that collection and uh, paste it where you want to share. Here in TweetDeck, uh, you can drag and drop tweets between collections too. Uh, you can do it by clicking on this cross, on the cross in the tweet you want to move, uh, and drag, and you can drop in the collection you want to put it. Really, I think this is a tool people are taking advantage of. Uh, well, talk uh, about people uh, we, who use Twitter a lot. And best of all, it's totally free. Well, thanks for watching this video. If you find it helpful, please give, give a like. On my Twitter collections, there are a lot of resources and knowledge from top creators. Let me know if you want to share with you those collections, even your Twitter user on the comments. Uh, those collections, uh, uh, those collections uh, are updated automatically every time I I put a new tweet on every collection. So uh, uh, leave your Twitter user on the comments if you want. Uh, I share with you this collection. See you next time.